welcome if you're new back with another swatching video my last one i didn't do no sound i didn't do no talking i just did music i really want to see how that one goes but this one is just going to be some you know couture polishes that i have that i haven't really swatched yet um these are the potted ones um that i wanted to put into my potted gel collection book because i have a specific book for those it's just little swatches of that the pink the purple the blue and the green summer potty gels from enel couture <laughs> So this pink one was really pretty. Um, I had discovered that I have to, you can't just paint these on. Just painting them on isn't gonna work too well. You have to really like put a nice amount on it, especially for a swatch. Um, I feel like you could do like a jelly look or you could do a glitter pack look with these potted gels. So what I discovered after doing the blue is that the blue is the number one, pink is number two, purple is number three, and the green is number four. noticing that I think I've <clears throat> loaded these backwards because I did not show you guys me swatching purple but I think it's in here I just put a top coat on them so that you know they're not sticky because they do have a sticky effect after you cure them and I need to put them inside of the book 
so that's what I'm about to do now I made a little spot I have four spaces left over from after I did my 36 um, swatches of my potty gels and here's four more potty gels that book I'm trying to make only potty gels I don't know how easy or how hard it's gonna be but I'm gonna do it so yeah I'm gonna let y'all watch this and I'll be back So these are the other, you know, couture polishes I got inside of my scoops. That one is a top coat. It is a shiny top coat. It's not part of the shiny top coats like Mars or Pluto or any of those. This is just the number one. And someone told me that the number two is gold. It has gold glitter in it. I don't have that one. I have one in three. They're kind of similar, but not. So this one is three. Um, I'm not sure if one or three had like some bigger flakes of glitter in it. Yeah, they're similar but they're not the same they have slight differences I think this is the one with the chunks of glitter in it the other one had fine grip glitters this has chunks of glitter and it's like a little milky this is me trying to see the difference between both of them one is a little more bluer and one is a little more milky but they similar I tried it on top of a colored uh, swatch stick just to see the difference but yeah it really <laughs> it really was not a difference you guys tell me if there was a difference I feel like the only difference is that that first one I tried on it had a little bit bigger glitter flex. And this is Galaxy Kitty number 12, number 012, sorry. So I already have swatched this on a black swatch stick. A little ring swatch stick and put it around the polish um, I did not remember that I already swatched this so I did it again and actually I feel like it looks better the second time instead of the first time okay and these are the striper liner um, polishes they were good I really like these and honestly I'm not gonna lie that pink one and that blue one, I love that combination. But that pink one, I might be having to use to cover a whole nail. Because that pink is nice.
here I'm, a, I'm getting ready to do the the swatch board cubes for these uh, Mowbray brand and um, I don't know what that other brand is um, it's, you can get it off of Timu but I got this stuff from out of colorful July's mystery scoop to give you between 15 to 20 items i think they gave me a little bit more actually but anyway um i think they're out of business by now that's why i bought it also but yeah so this this jelly right here this red jelly oh my god as soon as i saw it i was like it's giving vampire blood it's giving i want to drink your blood like i really really like this one right here i don't know how to describe it except for you know those ceramic pots that you put plants in those ceramic planters is given that terracotta i think that's what that's called i don't know but it's given the planter for the plants that you put on your porch i love it though i still like it it was a nice color it went on smoothly I'm just doing a second coat of both of them because I just felt like they needed one. And here is the start of the cat eye gel pouches from Mowbray that I was so excited that I got. Even though they didn't give me a magnet, it's cool because I have my own. But still, I was so excited to get those. I was so excited to get those cat eyes. Because I really don't have any cat eyes, but now I do. I have a nice collection of cat eyes that I just acquired so yeah i have videos of those coming out too and you know we're just we're just gonna keep making videos that's all and, you know what else is there to do but to love your hobby and make it a craft and here's the second one i like i like all three of them actually like i didn't have any complaints about it, none of them and when you turn these little squares over oh my god they look like water dancing so no complaints over this way i loved all these polishes that came in that box all the polishes that came in that box oh look at that you see that it is dancing i love it and they work so well So I'm just showing you guys how close up on them. They were so pretty. But this is the end of the video. I want to thank everybody for watching, liking, subscribing, tuning in, commenting, engaging, and doing everything they've been doing. I'm up to 107 followers now, and I love it. 